Hello YouTube, and today I'll be showing you how to uh, use the uh, privacy guard here in Android 4.4 KitKat. I'm not sure if it was uh, introduced in earlier versions, but it is in KitKat, definitely. So I'll be showing you how, uh, what it does and how we can use it to protect ourselves from unwanted people from looking at our contacts, phone, phone calls, logs, and all the other things like that. So let's say, for example, I want to get this super cool, super bright. LED torch and you know people like using torches now we just have a little read maybe oh wow look at this genius of the week it turns on the LED nothing really great about this app the strobe light function doesn't really hit the high enough Hertz range to call it a feature wow that was very stupid no shit it turns on the LED okay so let's just say we're gonna install this but the app permissions right it wants our storage, our location, our camera, our application information, phone calls, network. Wow, why would it need the phone call though? But let's just say this is the best one out there that's free. So we'll just download it. Uh huh. Ah, whoops. We'll just quickly launch it. So, you know, it looks fine. We've got some ads here. That's alright. But we don't want it reading our phone calls, just in case it ever does. So you have to go to settings, and then go to security. Then scroll down to um, app security, and you see privacy guard. Whoop. Privacy guard. Now here, you'll see all the list of applications that you've installed. So we'll just find the flashlight, which is at the very bottom. And if you tap it, it will instantly lock it, like that, with the security icon. But if you tap and hold you get to see all the permissions it has to, it can use so when you tap that little security icon down here when you like just tap the app to turn it on and off it automatically uh, shuts off the more private things such as the location read contacts call log calendar MMS but it obviously you'll have to use the camera for the flashlight settings and keep awake so that's all fine. So you can select the applications that you don't want reading your personal information just by tapping on it. So if I were to clear that and then see what it, what it can use. It's shortened down a bit, but uh, I think it, this, this definitely does help as, uh, with other applications as well. So you can uh, just have a look through them, such as this maybe MP3 downloader. I don't want it to read the location, contacts, call log. And it also gives you a very good um, like a reading of when it was ever used, the uh, permissions, which is also handy. So that's about it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you do like it, leave a thumbs up and a like down below. Uh, also, feel free to subscribe if you'd like to see more. And because it is closer to the Christmas holidays, I will be able to make more videos and hopefully show off uh, some hardware thingies. We'll talk to you guys in the next video.